And finally, London is playing host to a new arts exhibit that turns a childhood hobby into high art. The art of the bricks displayed was first created from simple Lego pieces. Our good friend Matt Morrison reports that the man behind the exhibit says he just wanted to have a creative outlet after he got home from his normal 9-to-5 job. Entering London's Art of the Brick exhibit is to enter a world where a child's imagination soars to new heights. 80 artworks fill the rooms of London's old Truman Brewery. They're made from more than a million Lego blocks, held together by simple glue. There are familiar faces and nods to classical art. Turn a corner and you'll come face to face with a six meter long dinosaur. New York-based artist Nathan Sawaya is the creative force behind the sculptures. While he may have ended up in Toyland, he started out in the business world. So when I got out of college, university, I decided, um, what am I going to do with my life? And I ended up going to law school, and I eventually practiced corporate law in New York City for several years. But I would come home from the law firm, and I would need some sort of outlet. And one day I just started sculpting, and I'd sculpted out of more traditional media, but I decided, could I sculpt out of Lego bricks, this toy from my childhood? So the art of the brick has attracted millions of visitors since it began a world tour in 2007. And there is big business at the center of all this visual playtime. After all, Lego overtook Mattel as the world's largest toy company just this year. Organizers say that while children are always welcome, this exhibit is not necessarily child's play. We've got a lot of friends here, a lot of people here, sorry, who are what they're called AFLs, or adult fans of Lego, of which there are millions. And they've all been coming through, and again, the vast majority of them are all massive fans of Nathan to see his own work themselves up close. But remember, you can look, but don't touch. It's the little ones that obviously, it's difficult, but we, we you know, they mustn't touch. We do keep on, and 99% to get the people absolutely fine, they get it. The Art of the Brick exhibit in London runs through early January for Lego lovers, young and old. Matt Morrison, CCTV.